The 2005 Glazer takeover of Manchester United can be traced back to a horse. Rock of Gibraltar was a champion racehorse and over the course of his two-year career, the horse set a world record seven consecutive Group 1 wins and was named 2002's European Horse of the Year. In 2001, Sir Alex Ferguson became the co-owner of Rock of Gibraltar alongside Susan Magnia, wife of John Magnia. The opportunity to invest in the horse was offered to Ferguson as a gift from Magnia, who at the time, along with his business partner JP McManus, was on the way to becoming a major shareholder at Manchester United. In 2003, the horse became the centre of a dispute between Ferguson and Magnia. The Rock's success inflated its value and increased the potential income from studding rights. Ferguson claimed that as co-owner of the horse, he was entitled to 50% of studding income, but the pair's contract was verbal and Magnia denied that this was the case. Ferguson took Magnia to court over the decision and thus began a very public legal battle. Initially, Ferguson attempted to sue Magnia for £110 million, half the estimated value of the horse, plus £10 million in legal fees. Following this, Magnia and McManus were alleged to have hired the help of a private detective to investigate Manchester United's transfer dealings, the report of which led to their infamous 99 questions presented to the Manchester United board. The questions concerned several controversial transfers, including those of Yap Stam and Tim Howard. The transfers were reported to be controversial largely due to the influence of external agents, one of whom was Jason Ferguson, Alex Ferguson's son. Jason was a director at the sports agency Elite, who it was later reported represented 13 of Manchester United's players. The confusion arose from fees paid to Elite and from transfer dealings in which the company appeared to have some representation on both sides of the deal. At the club, an internal report redefined their relationship with external agents, ensuring that those, like Jason, who had relationships with club employees, were unable to represent the club. In 2004, Ferguson greatly reduced his price and settled with Magnier on a lump sum payment of £2.5 million, officially ending the dispute. But as a result of the dispute, the club were keen to find new investors, and Magnia and McManus were perhaps encouraged by the affair to part with their major shareholding. In 2005, their 28.89% stake was transferred to Malcolm Glazer. Get it.